Hey guys, so let's do our daily card and energy clearing. Call upon God, Source Universe, our angels and guides, and the highest beings of divine infinite love and infinite light to support us. And whatever it is that we're meant to know and receive at this time. Oop, I guess here it is. <laughs> is this the card? This is the card. Okay. So if you're open to receiving, type in the comments below. You're open to receiving. This card is Rebirth. It says, reinvent yourself. Oh, I like this. Give life to your dreams. Give life to your dreams. Create a new reality. Ooh, so sparkly, so magical. Okay, let's tune in and see. So one of the messages coming through is that um, you've been wanting to upgrade certain parts of your life. You're just really feeling that energy, that pull within your soul. It's like it's time to up-level certain parts of your life. It's not time to let things go that's no longer serving you. And you know what they are because they've kind of been lingering in your mind, in your heart for a while. But now this is the time where it's really like, okay, it's almost like a tipping point. Like, all right, you're going to keep holding on to the past or you're going to just really finally fully step more forward into this new timeline, into the uh, the higher levels, the higher levels of light and consciousness where things are a lot more easeful and things can go a lot more flowy and smoothly, right? We'll still sometimes have these roadblocks and challenges, but it doesn't have to be like so, um, like, I'm just seeing like so like jaggedy, like so so harsh, right? It has to be so harsh. It can be it can be a gentle. It can be like this, right? We're still gonna have ups and downs, like the ebb and flow, but it's not like it's like, oh I can flow, right? Go with the flow. <laughs> it's kinda like that. So let's see what we can do. <laughs> okay. First I'm getting soften, soft soften. Feeling it in the heart area. This is related to you and your twin flame. I'm feeling how to do with twin flame union. So allowing both of your hearts to soften to one another. Just feeling some, you know, some resentment, some anger. This lifetime and other lifetimes is coming up now to the surface to be healed and released so you can come more fully together in union on all levels, physical, mental, emotional, spiritually, etc. <clears throat> okay. It's softening very quickly, <laughs> so that's good. Just allowing more of that love, the unconditional love and compassion to flow between the two of you. And now when your heart to soften and melt, just melt into this feeling of love and joy and bliss and gratitude right gratitude for yourself how far you've come on this journey through life <laughs> i know it's a lot <laughs> so it's fairly really i don't know if we take as much time as we should to to really thank ourselves right thank our bodies thank our souls for doing this <laughs> and also thanking our twin flame our twin flame's been with us every step of the way, right? Even though it might not look like that sometimes in the physical, the spiritually they are always there with you, holding your hand side by side every step of the way. They're there cheering you on, holding you when you're sad, always there for you energetically, right? No matter what. Okay. So just allowing that feeling to come more fully through so you can feel it more strongly. This sense of love and gratitude. Allowing your hearts to come more closer together. Mounting more fully together. Feels really good. Okay. And anything that might be coming up on the surface. Any fears, things like that. Just allow it to melt away easily and effortlessly. No big deal. Just melt it away. <laughs> And send it back to the light, to God, to the universe, whoever it is that it needs to go. Okay. Just allowing your hearts to open up more towards one another with ease and grace. Okay. Because when we do this, right, when you allow your heart to soften and open up more, then it gives you more 
more room to create. So, like, to really be able to move forward in your life and let the things go that are no longer serving you. If you feel that love and that gratitude for yourself and your heart, then you're naturally going to want to do it. It doesn't. It's not going to be like a like such a hard thing to do because it's just natural. Because you're just following the. Um, natural rhythms of your heart, of your soul. So the more we can connect more fully to ourselves, to our soul, it just gets easier to just move with that flow, right? So now you're flowing, right? When you're connected to your heart, you're flowing, right? Instead of ah! <laughs> flowing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so let's see what the question of the day is. Think about. What is what is one thing you would know what is one thing you no longer would like in your life? So like a releasing statement is like saying I no longer allow and then whatever it is that you no longer allow. And then the second part is I now call in and then da 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 so the I now call in you want that to be the positive and when you say I no longer allow is whatever it is that you want to release and let go. So you can do that, type in the comments below and share. Really excited to hear from you. And if you need any help and support, you can get a session with me. All my information is below. And one of my specialties is heart opening and expansion and allowing you to go with the flow, right? So you take ex take your action. It'll be a lot more easier because you'll be moving with your soul instead of I have to do this and it's like this whole big hard thing when we clear all that let those things go all those layers then it's like it's easier right we can just flow through life so for example there's something you've been wanting to do it's not like it has to be this like such a hard difficult <laughs> resistance thing right when you're going against your heart when you're working with your heart and working with the divine and then you're like Ooh, this is fun <laughs> so yeah let me know i'll see you tomorrow bye